All right, guys, since here, and welcome to another vape video. I haven't done one for a while. Uh, life's been cookie. Got the football on over there, so if I do look over there, it's just to see what scores. And yes, here's a mess, but enough about that. What we are here to talk about today is the flawless production. All right. So here we are, the vapus, the the, the flawless vapor uh, RDA. Really enjoying it. Um, made in America, really well made actually. I must admit that. But what we need to do is take a close look at this, and uh, yeah, let's do that right now. All right, here we go. Uh, it is broken down into its two main parts. We have the deck and we have the top cap. It has two Cylon slots, one there and one on the other side. Uh, that's pretty much it really. It has a wide bore drip tip top, whatever you really want to call that. It's Conical design near the uh, drip tip, and on one side it says flawless. Oh no, it doesn't. Sorry, it says. I can't read it upside down. It says production, and on the other side it has flawless MFC, which is manufacturing company, and that says. 100% American made and if you uh, they do do in a range of colors the shop I got from me had two colors left they had the black and they had the white which does not work in this lighting but you can see the Cylon slots a lot better so we're just gonna tough it out with this with this black one so yeah that's pretty much all to see on the top cap on the base is just a three post dripper. I currently have a build in here which I'm using, which is the Anarchist Wire 24 gauge, three mil screwdriver, um, and it comes out to 0 0.2, 0 0.21 ohms, which is absolutely fine the way I use it because I mainly use these on mech mods and unregulated boxes so yeah um the center pin i never actually looked let me have a look no they're all they're all stainless steel in there uh we have two fins type things sticking out here which uh i'm not really a fan of you are supposed to put your build like there I've built it so I just negate the airflow but this does match up with that and it does you see there half the airflow is now is now yeah now closed off so really that is pretty much it oh sorry it has a silver or stainless steel I should say a 510 pin it is I don't know how well I can really show you because my camera's not behaving it does have a decently long 510 uh, pin it's blurry as all hell because my camera won't focus but yeah it does have a decent enough 510 pin so it is safe to use on hybrids so I am going to stick this back on my H cigar DNA 200 with my drawers mask. I'm going to put the top cap back in the right place. And that's never going to see that. It is at 60 watts. So, yeah, I'm happy, perfectly happy now to get back to normal view 
and vape on it properly and talk to her about it a little bit more. Oh, come on, we'll stop jumping. Yeah, so that's it. The, uh, the production cap or production RDA, not cap. Production RDA by Flawless. Uh, like I said, if you want it in, I have two. They are in white and black. And I reckon they look, they look really nice. They're quite easy to build on. If you build next to the wall, it does get in the way a little bit. But if you th if you think, pff, me, if you do think that is enough airflow for you on either side, then you just build away from them like I do. Yeah, it's working well. Uh, it's quite loud. If you can hear this, well, you probably heard this anyway. But yeah, it's quite a loud one, really. But yeah, that is it. Thank you very much, John. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good day.